Hey guys, today we are making a shampoo or shampoo bars. So let's get started here. With my coconut oil. So close. Okay. And then BTS 50. Okay. I am going to put this on the stove to melt. I'm going to add a green vibrance color. stove to melt and then we'll bring you guys back. Okay, so we're back to add in the rest of our stuff. So we have 10 grams, let's see. Fragrance. Okay. And then our citric acid a solution. And then our oats. Oops. Making a mess. That's what I do. This stuff is messy. And then our panthenol. the powdered gold. <laughs> so good for you though. So close. Oh my god, I thought I would do it. There we go. Okay. Now it's best just to get in there, your hands here. And I will. After I stick this in the microwave to warm it up again. Up. And when I come back, we'll get this in the pan. Okay, guys, and we're back. Let's try to make sure this is all good and mixed. 
you hear in the background is candles. <laughs> I'm sorry, wax melts. <laughs> Hot, 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 hot. Oh yeah, so hot. Messy. I'm telling you, if messes are not your thing, bath and body products, not for you. Because <laughs> you never believe the kind of messes we get into making this stuff. It's crazy, crazy. It's crazy. Okay. I don't remember. Get in there. Get a really press in there. Really. If you have a bath bomb press, and honestly, I want to get one just for shampoo bars. Sounds crazy, I know, but it's, you know, they know how to compact this stuff really well. And as strong as I'd like to think I am, which actually I'm not anymore. You know, these bath bomb presses, they know what they're doing. Okay, it's firming up on me now. So. Make sure I get it all here, as much as I can anyway. You know, there's always going to be some ways to hate it. Okay, guys. I'll be back this time down the Thank you so much for watching. Come over, I see you. I wonder it going to be the last time. Holding back these feelings. I wonder it going to be the last time.